be coming this side but that's fine we would just have to adjust and deal with it maybe we can ha ah, perfect now i don't have to worry about facing the wrong direction um and so i don't know already is locked rotate oh okay rotate device back <laughs> okay that's fine i'm gonna just wait for my ninjas to come in how are you guys doing and i know it's just one of those lives that are not scheduled and i know you guys hate them i promised you i was not going to do this again but here we are am i upside down right now i changed it guys am i upside down am i upside down okay 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 i changed back your oh, ninjas and shade you guys are the queens and kings of shade honey okay can you hear me properly i just am doing a quick live this is with my phone i don't even have any light so lighting might look crazy and <sighs> ninjas how are you guys doing so i guess this is the first live um in 2022 today is just one of those days for me um and i don't know i just wanted to talk to you guys i won't i don't want to get emotional i don't think i will get emotional in this video but i don't know i'm just feeling a bit overwhelmed today and i think it's just one of those days and i know we all go through those days um and today i guess i'm having mine and so I just wanted us to just sit and just talk because I know you guys always lift my mood always. So yeah, today I'm going to be using you guys to sponge off your positive energy. Um, as I was waiting for Dino Ranaka video, which video my ninja? Um, compliments to the new year, my ninjas. Compliments to the new year. Um, and I just wanted us to talk oh see the thing is i didn't even watch it i'm gonna have to go and watch it i saw apparently there was some havoc there i saw that trending on twitter um and so i'm gonna I'll, I'll watch it for you guys i'll watch it and then i'm sure the video will come out tomorrow um but i just wanted to talk to you guys how is the new year treating you um any new year's resolutions and um <laughs> oh, I mean, you should queen ninja you should leave your hair alone so cute thank you um are you gonna save this ninja yeah i'm gonna save it so doesn't mean you should click off though but i will make sure that i i i i, I save it um i am fine guys i am i'm fine i just feel like today i'm just not feeling my best dieting is on my top list child i've been also there i've been trying i've been making sure that i cook and unfortunately cooking comes with washing the the dishes okay it's not my favorite spot but i'm forced to do it so i'm like i'm cooking i'm washing those plates and i'm cleaning the house because last year i was not cooking like that hence my place would be clean and my helper would come once a week but now we're not going to sit with the dirty dishes and wait for my helper to come that once a week. So every day now I have to be cooking and cleaning up and I'm just like, <laughs> it's crazy you guys, but it's, it's not nice. It's honestly not nice. I obviously want to lose weight this year, but wow, it's not easy because you have to cook. You can't be eating out. It would be very expensive if you did so I, I don't think that i have any other choice honey i don't think that i have any other choice but i'm gonna have to learn how to meal prep um and yeah try vegan diet actually i can do a vegan diet because i'm not really much of a fan when it comes to meat anymore um i prefer like seafood over meat so i think that i can definitely do that i did buy like a vegetarian wrap 
yesterday and it was really so nice tasted so nice and i was really actually happy about it so <sighs> Ooh, try the egg diet works wonders guys I, I i will but the unfortunate part with the egg diet is that yay if you let one out i'm sure everyone next to you um is gonna be out are you with your sisters no they're back in venda if you want to lose weight try see um more so you can do your research out uh, yeah that's true um try color count counting how many calories are there in a pub because i don't know i'm still at the stage where i have to reduce my portion when it comes to pub because i honestly cannot just um go ham how did the lemon and coffee go for you it actually goes well i'm back on that i'm having that i'm gonna try also mix um intermediate fasting just because i remember last of last year it actually worked for me but then last of last year i was also going through a lot of changes so we don't know was it really intermediate fasting or was it also stress um but yeah so i will also be starting to do smoothies and stuff i just i wanna um why about to stop eating carbs including pap and rice guys can the wire win this world because i don't get it you know like we're gonna be here and we don't even enjoy food because we don't wanna get fat and then before we know it we are gone and we never got to enjoy ourselves intermediate fasting and calorie counting yes that definitely works it had worked for me do what works for your body sis child what works for my body is eating everything i want um pop whatever junk and whatever but i'm trying try brown rice instead of white rice guys i have tried brown rice it tastes like crap i <laughs> my ninjas there is nothing that has to do with weight loss that is fun honestly especially when you're still starting lemon and coffee made me sick bp was extremely high i would get that i mean i would understand that my bp is fine but i see that you know i get heart bend so i just take like um what is the name of those pills forgot about it but i take those pills for heart pain so then i'm fine me i'm staying off calves um till i reach my desired weight no cigars especially savannah i have no idea why women drink that guys eh. this whole weight loss thing is just a bit depressing you see people that have done it and they've lost a lot of weight um and it's like Losing and maintaining weight is not pop and flays. Eh? It honestly is not my ninja. Honestly, it is not. And I think that the part that I'm most like conscious about is my belly, you know? Because my cover guys, it's it's big. And um, I mean that comes from the fibroids, but I also have fats in there that are just for food. So from food. So drink water before eating you will thank me later okay i'll do that actually i would actually do that i would drink warm water before i eat immediately before i eat right before i eat so i hope that that will work guys thank you so much for all these advices guys ah 2022 i really want to get to my desired weight and it's a it's a way to go to the weight that i desire i don't want to be skinny i don't want to be skinny but i want to lose weight so i guess that you know it is what it is um and i think 2022 don't do extreme fasting they mess up with your metabolism yeah intermediate fasting i feel like it's fine if you eat eight hours a day um i think that is fine I, I did it and it was fine for me last time so you eat out eight hours and then um you don't eat for 16 <laughs> i love food hate my stomach gym not uh, my week what gym not my watch my week uh, gym not with my week finance will try do gym at home guys can you believe i even have a treadmill that i'm not even using i feel like so i guess every year has its own struggles you know but i would rather have to struggle with the fight with the weight than the stresses i've been dealing with but i'm gonna use the treadmill my ninja how long does the fibroids belly take to go had mine removed and jen still uh baiting big time guys that the tummy doesn't go unless if i guess you tie 
but it's extremely painful to tie that 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 tummy after the fibroids because the operation of the fibroids and this is what i was told is actually more invasive than actually a woman giving birth and the reason for that is because a woman giving birth is not cut up inside she's only cut up outside and then they obviously have to get those layers back but when you have your fibroids removed they go in and they cut and they have to switch, switch like you know do the suturing from the inside and then also have to do the suturing from the outside so i remember last day when i tried to tie child i got this excruciating pains that i just could not honestly i really just could not so i i stopped and so my belly is still there honey i don't know if you find another way you can go ahead and tell me but ah uh, i love you always look good thank you ninja i love you too so yeah it's just part of the struggle but i feel like whenever i stay away from certain foods i do see my belly go down a little bit but oh, it's not easy it's not easy oh it's not easy <laughs> it's not easy honestly it's it's not easy at all at all at all honey it's not easy i wonder how people that do it and lose a lot of weight um um you know they do i see a lot of influencers going to dr nandi as well um the other unfortunate part about it is that it's very expensive if you're looking for something like tummy tuck and stuff you're looking at around eighty thousand rands. that's not chicken money so you have to choose do i go to the gym or do i take 80k that i can do something with and um actually go do it and i think for me i've thought of it but i was like but you've never really given yourself a chance you've not gone to the gym like proper for like three months eat healthy for three months and you know just see what happens and i know my body you guys like it adjusts fast i'm just i i'm lacking the strength right now and i think it's now starting to affect me a bit because i'm starting to feel like because i thought that by now i was gonna be fine today's the seventh like yes a lot of influencers they go for liposuction and tummy tuck and all that that's true but those procedures are not that dangerous like that dangerous um procedures as well um so I, guys you know we don't want to die simply for looks you know so yeah i think last year i was just dealing with the whole process of the divorce and stuff and so this year i feel like i want to just dedicate this year to myself and um i need to definitely have something hey ninja with nice life problems some of us mjolok if i do guys don't ever let mjolok be your biggest problem in life honestly it's not worth it it's not worth it if your mjolo is the biggest problem in your life right now girl kohela true with that money you can rather exercise and eat less but i have to say your face is amazing makeup skills thank you ninja i have a beautiful face okay um this year we're also going to continue the journey because last day i had stopped to go see the dermatologist and the reason for that was because she is not cheap you know um but this year i'm like okay if i'm gonna be cooking i'll obviously save a lot of money in terms of i won't be eating out constantly guys someone is knocking at my door um hi love sorry hi sorry i'll i'll come to you ne? i'm i'm live i don't know someone is knocking at my door but when i'm talking it's like no one is answering but okay that's fine love you ninja love you too um so yeah you know i mean we're gonna lose the face is gonna go a bit because i i realized that's what happened when i lost last day can you do tummy tuck but fats will find a comfortable place go like arms or face the more in your body see that's the truth though i can have a flat tummy and have arms this big doesn't make sense i have seen someone you guys that has this huge booty huge thighs and a flat flat tummy i know there are certain people that that happens for but guys i'm telling you most of them mm -mm, girl it always goes together sorry who is it sorry sorry 
Oh, yes, love. I will, I will call you, ne? Kito Visa. I'm, yeah, get live on YouTube. I'm live on YouTube. Yeah, get your phone, ne? Sharp. Oh, guys, I'm sorry. That's my neighbor. <laughs> So yeah guys um wow yeah, she. ladies do Chloe thing exercise free on YouTube yeah so there's also that <laughs> love stop Shay. it's our time with Shibubu. <laughs> so yeah um what did I want to say exercising from videos on youtube i find that that's fine i know a friend of mine um that is that is doing that and she lost her um hi ninja the name of the pills please i sometimes struggle with heartburn the name of those pills is um guys i just bought them they're right over there Listen, after I'm done here, just go to my community. I'll, I'll post, I'll put a community post and I will show you guys. Or better yet, I will do a video and explain everything to you guys because those pills have saved my life. I've struggled with heartburn for the longest time. I can literally eat something that doesn't even have oil and i will be burning like nobody's business so yeah it's i just forgot the name but it's that right here um is it not gaviston honestly no shade to gaviston but gaviston has never relieved my heartburn i think it goes with the level i had severe heartburn guys because of heartburn i've even had to go and do the gastroscope guys no let me get you those pills let me get you those pills they're right here i'm coming Oh, I got it. I got it. I got it. Guys, the name of the pills is called Omiflux. Omiflux, honey. Omiflux. The, the level of hard burn I would have, Gaviscon can't do nothing. I've tried Gaviscon. I have tried it and it didn't work. I even had to go for um like the gastroscopy and they saw nothing because i thought maybe i've got like stones or something there was nothing and they were like we don't understand maybe it's just indigest i've suffered with heartburn that's why pills like this i will recommend to anybody i will do a video on these pills if you struggle with heartburn watch this video that probably would be the whew, the title of that video so that's exactly what i'm going to do for you guys my people like honestly let's help each other i've struggled the person that put me on those pills is my friend label when you find us like popping those pills together because this is the thing that people some people don't understand with heartburn it's not necessarily because of you are big that's the reason why have you seen how small my friend is and even now when she's not pregnant like she gets heartburn and she's so small so it just it's with your digestive system and i think something is definitely not too right because there's no way i can be getting all this hard burn and whatnot so omi flux that's the one do they also relieve bloating i don't know about bloating no they don't really relieve bloating um so but i did ask yeah yes it's for acid um reflux and ulcers so i had acid reflux and oil and whatever they don't help with bloating because I, I still be bloated as hell but um they do help with heartburn my people that much i can tell you they help a lot and also um i do have a lot of tricks i found last day i was experimenting a lot with different things and so i will tell you guys like when it comes to like different stuff i saw someone talking about the skincare routine at this moment you guys my skin is a mess honestly um because of when the, the heat the sun it just so i would do that uh probably because now i'm still doing my skin care routine my skin will get better i'm sure by end month end i'm going to actually have that video so i also just wanted advice with you guys um i have a channel so the channel that i have is the channel that was my vlogging channel with my ex 
and the channel's already monetized i put it in private but the channel is monetized if i put a video out today it's going to pay it's monetized so i don't have any resilience or resistance when it comes to that but i feel like the direction of my content you guys has changed a little bit the things that i enjoy filming are no longer the same as i enjoyed as before i feel like my whole channel was just entertainment and i enjoyed that so much but there's a part of me that has also just enjoyed doing personal videos however i feel like i've worked so hard for my main channel to be an entertainment channel i've formed many celebrities for it and i i feel like maybe i should go ahead and just change that channel name to me and um start uploading just random videos over there if i want vlogs like it will all just be about me and it's not mixed with like any entertainment videos um makeup and whatever and it's going to be a drama free place because anyone that follows me there it's not gonna be like oh why not posting entertainment because it won't be an entertainment channel it will just be about me my story times and you know like this itty bitty stuff that you guys want to know but then again i'm gonna be honest with you guys i asked myself will i be able to cope with two channels because i do have another channel that i girl it has over five thousand subscribers and i did not i did not continue with it it's there that one is actually even public so i don't know but um i think so i think that i'm going to do that and you guys can get to see sometimes behind the scenes like the the tour and whatnot and i can just be free and you know whatever i want over there um i think that guys oh drink a lot of water i actually don't drink a lot of water so i'm definitely i'm going to take um you guys' advices so i think you know maybe it's one of those stuff that i'm going to talk about is that um guys like 2020 2021 crazy 2020 a fucking shit show um 2021 it was like a flood of the negative and a flood of the positive that was now starting to come but um yeah pain really changes who you are i honestly like i'm just like <laughs> you know the things that you see as important um sometimes are not anymore the things that you thought this was everything to me not it's a very confusing space um and all that especially like when you're going through or you're dealing with pain and so it did change me a bit man i just felt like okay yes we're talking about celebrities yes we do laugh yes we do cry yes we do get angry we swear at each other sometimes we defend each other most times we love each other yes but i felt like if i went through what i went through and i then realized that i entered into um this new spectrum where i understood certain things a little bit better why would i not want to share that with my followers and so i think that a personal channel is going to do me well um and yeah i'm gonna just have to have the strength to continue also doing my entertainment um videos which girl has been going i think that the editing part is the one that i've been struggling a bit honestly um and i would definitely be getting an editor this year for sure for sure um they're very expensive so i don't want to put in a lot of money because i don't have that much money um and so i'm still just trying to find out how i can actually do it um at a price that's not going to break my bag you know so yeah 2021 was a blessing but also a pain in the s omg child it was a blessing and a pain in the bud honey like it was crazy um a lot was going on in the back in the background and mind you guys majority of the year i wasn't even talking about it um only started talking about it i think it was september something like that and obviously like it was just crazy and stuff but you guys can see 2021 you've got to see 2020 child that year almost killed me so yeah i think that that's what i'm going to do um i'm gonna get a new channel and i guess i don't know when we're going to start but i hope that it's going to be soon 
um for me to just get the strength um to actually do it and i think that maybe i just also want to say if you're someone that is out there and you're dealing with a lot and maybe you're going through like your lazy day like today of how I'm, I'm feeling i don't think i'm lazy i just feel like i'm feeling down you know i was thinking about my mom as well and stuff and um yeah why not teach your sister how to edit so i could simply do that but she's gonna be going to school um she's gonna be going to school and obviously i also do want them to have their own um careers you know so that's the only reason why uh, i'm not and i don't want maybe to teach her and then she can do it here and there i want her to fully focus on her studies um because she's gonna be starting a four-year degree course so it's not something that is you know to play with um and uh yeah so you guys know i always talk about like it's not everyone obviously that's going to eat by hustle it's not everyone that even has those capabilities and so she can go to school and study and yeah so that's the reason why i'm not teaching her she's not even here right now she's at home she's gonna come back immediately when she's going to school which is going to be staying at her own rest um and so that's the reason why you guys but i'm making plans on what is it that i can do and how i can do it um but yeah i'm a businesswoman guys i'll make a way i'll find a way i'll make a plan um so yeah i know there's certain people that look at me and they're like oh i don't encourage people to go to school my own mother's child is going to school and trust and believe my girl was out here basically doing her best to make sure that happens so school is still very important you guys it's still very important you just also have to make sure that you get um a person i mean a a, a a a course that's going to give you a job you made my days these kids playing just uh dressed working at home <laughs> how much do editors cost guys depending some people will charge you 2.5 for a video it depends how long your video is whatever and sometimes people just look at you and they think you have money so their prices go crazily up um but I'm going to make a plan. I'm really definitely going to make a plan on what is it that I'm going to do and how I can do it. And the last time I got a PA, she was working from here and it just did not work out for us. But, um, yeah, things are going to um, work out. Exercise or I mean, even home workouts, get some hemp like See, that's the thing. I've been wanting to exercise and I've been super lazy and I've been feeling depressed because of it. Like, not depressed. I've been feeling down because of it. Because I'm like, you're so lazy. Go work out. And I'm just sitting there like. <laughs> so, oh, the first week of January down, honey. And Mugo has not exercised. But I'm like, this year is not going to be like any other, many other years. Guys, there's nothing I put my mind to that I really put my mind to. And I, it doesn't come to pass. I'm someone that's very positive And I'm going to do it um so i'm just telling myself that that girl you are of strong mind you are of strong will you are a freaking beast at getting things that you want so go get that body girl if you could divorce or live in zosa for jewelering and not tolerate that nonsense why not divorcing this feds that's what i say to myself and i will just sit there and i'll be cracking laughing by myself so i just start like building myself up you know guys i even bought a smartwatch to track them damn calories not calories but to track like steps and what because i'm like when i'm exercising i will need something so i bought the watch why am i not starting crazy awful it's just awful <laughs> yeah don't worry ninja next week still good day to start that's true i edit in each video is like 350 so they are not coming from the intention of helping yeah that's true but if you edit and one video is 350 and i upload like three videos a day and remember my videos don't need like extra edits um because you just place the pictures and um that's it come to my dms ninja let's see if maybe we cannot agree to a price that we can be able to work together with um and just see because maybe you can help me here and there you know when it comes to that 
2022 is definitely our year or i mean guys 2022 we are grabbing money i don't know who's with me in this money grabbing change i don't know but girl girl 2022 we are grabbing money i remember i used to say to you guys that guys i'm going to uh, to the top and i would drag as many people as possible i've always said that so now i'm saying 2022 we are grabbing money i don't know who's with me or not but i'm really going to do uh, uh, my best to make sure that i'm getting that money Shibubu, okay um so yeah it's definitely a year of making money uh what i'm going to also do is that this year because last year i think guys ninjas are just you guys are the best shame i won't lie and the reason for that is because someone would pay for a shout out and i'm going through depression or i'm going through my down state and i won't post for a week or almost two and no one's gonna be out there telling blogs or when we took my money blah 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 and when i apologize most of the ninjas would be like hey um you know um let's um what do they call this let's um like it's okay when i try to actually apologize and so i was also thinking of this year but see that's the thing i've got a lot of stuff but i was thinking of this year like something is going to come you guys something is going to come that can also just help us all but what i'm saying is that this year i'm gonna be more um into if you're booking an appointment to consult when it comes to youtube the latest you can get it will be at least the consultation should be at least two days you understand what i'm saying so um so that at least you know you guys can be able to get that we're also going to do i'm gonna host a class the first class is gonna have to be soon um where i show you guys how to edit because remember i know how to edit the only difference is that i feel like i've got a lot of stuff that i actually want to do and editing every single video has now just become a bit difficult and all that so i'm thinking that you know I'm going to want to teach you guys at least how to edit so that you can know how to edit. And who knows, maybe from the people I teach, I might even end up getting an employee, um, you know, in the same group. So that's what I want. I think that skill should be taught, you know. If we know the skill, we know how to do it, then we can do it. Um, because, guys, I am fully on YouTube. Like, this is my full bread. And I'm not doing bad for myself. So I think that someone out there can also be able to do it so yeah and i think that i'm also going to have to show you guys like how to be confident the tips that i've used for myself that have worked and um just my experience in general guys can you believe i've been youtubing for five years because 2017 2018 2019 2020 2021 2022 five years and that's we've been doing this thing so cheers to the next five years i've also started and lost two cages now started last week of december then i gave cheat day once a week <sighs> girl i mean two cages is a lot i mean oh i mean you are so lovely and kind oh thank you my love it's my birthday today but i feel so down and lonely um a lot happened last day hoping for a better 2022 first of all my ninja happy birthday um i love you so much happy birthday and if you had a tough year trust and believe um you're gonna have a better year just have that positive mentality you will happy birthday my love happy happy birthday um then the ninja this one says hi queen ninja i also want to be a youtuber marayo um scum say Oh, <laughs> guys you are never ever going to get anything unless if you are bold about it yes my ninjas can we please say happy birthday to our ninja oh, i love you guys you guys are so sweet so you are never ever going to get anything unless if you persevere and you also need to understand that sometimes there are certain things that will happen along the way that will make you feel like you want to lose hope and not do it and i'll go ahead and give you guys an example i remember 20 i was it 28 19 
there was a group that was taken by youtube black to atlanta and at that time they'd taken creators that had a hundred thousand subscribers or more at that time i had a hundred thousand subscribers and i was not invited and i remember i was so crushed and i was so down i felt like youtube was just not recognizing me like what the hell and then um after that you guys i remember someone enunju even went on twitter and said hey hey owami talks about she has a lot of views she has subscribers but um youtube does not even recognize her and i remember actually telling her for sake the girl but i my heart was so painful and then what i didn't know was that they approached people the time that um it was before i hit a hundred thousand so my name was not even there because it was before i hit so they they selected the people sent the messages months before i hit a hundred thousand then and my name was not there but 2020 when it came to the youtube black i was selected and i was obviously part of the youtube black 2021 which came with a lot more benefits than just flying to atlanta which i appreciated and so i was like had it been that i was someone that was like i'm going to leave i'm going to quit i would never have seen this nice thing so yeah you do need to be strong um and you do need to understand that when you're like on youtube and stuff you are working with people some people have got their own you know way of bringing that is not the best but you have to deal with it so when it comes to editing a thumbnail i'm also going to show you guys i think the 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 problem that i have with some of this stuff is that i would teach people how to edit a thumbnail what i do and instead of someone taking what i am showing you and going and being creative with your thumbnails the person is going to come and copy my thumbnails exactly now i've just screwed myself because people now can't realize that this is a woman's signature um you understand so i it makes things a bit difficult when it comes to that but um when i'm hosting the class i will definitely give all the tips that i can i just don't like the fact that there are lazy youtubers that honestly just goes out there and just copy people's work like mm. I cannot relate, can never be me, you know. But some people honestly just have no shame. So that's the only reason why you've never really seen me like do a video to say, hey, this is how I edit my thumbnails. This is how I cut out my pictures. Because if I do that, the whole of freaking YouTube that is entertaining and whatnot, people will be doing their videos exactly like mine. Um, you ain't looking at the camera, my love. Is that a mirror there? no these are pictures yeah because this is where i'm supposed to be looking is it yeah here so if i'm looking like that then i'm looking at you guys but it's weird it's weird for me because i'm looking at you guys's comments you you guys's comments are coming this way that's why i'm looking this way but yeah i'm sorry for that this is a phone that i'm going on and um yeah so yeah 2022 guys let's go out there let's make money um being a woman that is financially independent is something that i preach every day it's something that has saved my life it's something that i've seen actually works so we definitely have to make sure that we strive for that and we do that because if we do not then you are honestly in a lot of trouble so please also make sure that you follow me on tiktok it's you can search owami entertainment or boldly owami and um you know obviously there are many videos there that i actually do um i feel like it's so easy that you can be someone that has struggled and you are now at a point of comfort and you forget about other people like you forget that oh Konja, you know people are still struggling out there and um i i don't ever want to be that type of person you know um last year in 2020 i feel like there's a lot of thing, things that have changed um but i think it was also just because i was also dealing with a lot of pain so i had to put myself first i don't think that i did enough just to help um you know my people but this year i made a better place mentally so this year we're going to do a lot you guys i'm thinking of something that i can be able to do to also help you guys maybe like also get jobs so if someone is looking for a job i think that will be something that i would do um for free um and then maybe i will just have a program where my editor can just compile you guys' videos and 
we can put out like CVs or pictures of what is it that you the job you're looking for and we share we make sure that it's out there on um um on twitter and on other platforms let's not just use social media for fun let's also use it to like help ourselves you know so yeah those are some of the stuff that i've been sitting and thinking about um it's just that sorry sometimes they're a bit difficult because you know i also have a lot on my plate but if i can actually um get help in terms of getting a pa and someone that will help me with this stuff i feel like i can be able to do a little bit more but this year we're going to go strong and hard into documentaries so <coughs> and the documentaries are not about celebrities trust and believe um they're gonna be about real people and real issues and i'm super excited about that i can be like interviewing and some are gonna just be people telling their stories it has nothing to do with oh i mean but it has everything to do with inspiring other people and just you know sometimes when you've gone through something and you see someone that has gone through the same thing that is flourishing and doing better and has found better copy mechanisms trust and believe like it, it makes you feel so good you know and so that's exactly what i want to do um and so that's exactly what i'm going to do guys 2020 is gonna be a great year um we're, we're gonna do so much it's gonna be a great year so the video is already 40 minutes i love you my ninjas um do you still use the same maid from Mbumalang? unfortunately no because if she came here she would have to stay with me and i am single i need to mingle i don't want to stay with nobody now <laughs> uh my resolution is to buy a car no matter how small it is as long as it's mine viva cc and you are going to actually do it you are definitely going to do it. Um, documentaries would be great episodes if you visit the people in their locations. That's exactly what I'm going to do. And that's the reason why I bought an SUV. Um, because I wanted to do that. Last year, I just failed to do that because some things didn't make uh, come together. And I was also just mentally not okay. I feel this year, I'm at a place where I'm going to do that. Um, and yeah, we're going to shoot real life documentaries and I'm super excited about that. And I'm super happy about that. So, yes. Uh, my ninja PA, I'm here, ninja. <laughs> oh my God, guys, I'm not going to look for a PA exactly right now. But when I do, I might go ahead and tell you guys if I've not gotten someone. But I already have an offer and we are still doing things in the background. We're going to just see. The person is going to edit um, or that's what we're going to try and agree on. I just, I'm not so, I'm so undecided um, at this moment. But yeah, I still need to organize because I need to obviously like just, there's a lot of stuff that needs to go into it. So Yeah. I love you ninjas and um, I will see you guys in my next upload. Mwah. Bye.